Hi, I'm Sonia, Intuitive Impressor. This is a collective reading for Aries. Welcome, Aries! So, don't try and force the crown to fit. It might belong to a different king or queen, and know that it can be flipped around because it's a universal crown. So, only take what resonates and leave the rest with someone else. And please be careful of scammers. Do not get scammed. I know that I will not reach out to you for a private re reading. You have to reach out to me first. And also, um, do not click any strange links in the comment section. That is a scam. Um, so, these cards that I'm using are Mystic Dreamer Tarot by Heidi Duress and Barbara Moore and Rider Wake right Tarot by Pamela Coleman Smith. So, Aries. This is Pisces Cancer Scorpio Energy. So, this person is quite caring, quite loving, and it looks like that it could be that this person is you. Also, someone you are dealing with. You don't have to have this star sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, but this person is very caring, very loving, very in touch with their emotions. So this is also a union. So this is like celebrations, coming together and celebrating with somebody. So this could be coming back with meeting friends, old friends, or it could be like a love relationship where you have this union. But it also looks like maybe someone might have refused to choose you somebody might have been stuck at a crossroads and maybe that you offered somebody love but actually they didn't take your offer of love because this cup here someone has rejected this love that um, they've been offered so this could be that this person here maybe rejected your love offer um, so they don't have to be Pisces Cancer Scorpio but they usually are like they could have a job as a counselor or a healer so this person see that they, they rejected your offer of love this could be that spirit has given this um love offer to this person but they rejected it and this has kept them this is like if this is you also take off the blindfold and decide what you want so that you can, uh, can clear, clear clearly come into you so there's this Knight of Pentacles here. This person is very slow moving. They take their time and they like they plow the field before they go to war so that everyone has, is looked after. So they take their time and they do things carefully, but they, they may take a little bit of time to come forward. So we it's interesting because we have these two. So this one and this one. So this is the one that we first started with. So it looks like this there's this other person here who is a Libra Gen Gemini Aquarius energy who is wanting to come in and be somebody stable this person is grounded and they can also be very intelligent they can be a business person like a lawyer doctor and someone that's very intelligent they uses their intellect for their job they've been watching from afar from a distance possibly that you've been betrayed and there's like trickery and thievery and they're wanting to come in and be somebody stable slow moving but stable and this is also a positive news cycle so there's been um you know some sort of difficult situation you've gone through and they've seen you go through some hard times and they're wanting to come in and balance the scales and this is like the the, the wheel turning in your favor where you're getting rewarded so there's this person that wants to come in and be somebody that takes their time and does things properly so they might be quite traditional as well so there's two energies here there's two masculine energies there's um that are coming in that are coming into this reading so this is the distant past so it looks like that there's been some sort of betrayal this is that you've had to maybe walk away from somebody somebody that has um gone behind your back maybe they could have been a bit of gossip as well maybe they stab you in the back so you've had to kind of walk away and this has also been a bit of instability it's because it's been quite a bit of a change that you've dealt with and it's sort of like maybe it's that just spoken your truth and you've had to sort of cut people out that have not been good for you you've seen the truth of things and you've moved forward so you've moved forward and this is spirit is also that's wanted you to move forward from these kind of betrayal sort of energies this is this is a new beginning here and spirits blessing you this is like spirit blowing the horn here and this is like people rising up and getting you know rewarded and others getting judgment so if the people that have done you wrong here they're getting they're getting judgment now so you are you know people are seeing the truth of things as well that they're seeing that you're a true person and this is also balancing of the scales as well so the, the balance is also that you're getting generational wealth so you work so hard and this is like the balance here 
It looks like there could be a court situation even, and it looks like it's going to go in your favour because you're getting rewarded generational wealth as well. So um, someone else is missing out on this opportunity, and this is also like abundance here. This is like rewards, a, a pop, rewarding new cycle here. This is amazing. This what you what what's coming in here from in the past, and it's after this betrayal. So it looks like you're getting rewarded from spirit for after this horrible time that you've had in the past. So recently, immediate past, this is like happily ever after. So it looks like you could have had your happily ever after. Or that looks like that um, maybe that's coming in for you at the moment. Because it looks like you've had to leave someone behind who has been a tri trickery, thievery, somebody that has been dishonest. So you've left this person in the cold here. And like after that, you know, this is when you get this, um, you know, happily ever after. Because this past situation was quite burdensome. And this is the endings as well. So this is actually like the end of burdens, carrying this sort of trickery and thievery, being left in the cold and that sort of thing. So this is like being really heavy for you, really hard to carry. And this is like, so once you put down this burden and you heal from this past situation, it's going to get a lot easier. Things are going to move faster. Because it's also that you've worked very really hard here. This is like you getting rides raising money and like putting so much effort into the work that you do so this is like also that it's like working on yourself as well so things are starting to move faster now and this is like you manifesting this happily ever after so this is beautiful especially after this difficult time these the, these cards here as well the 10 10 there's 10 10 and that's about mastery so, so this is your thoughts at the moment this is like Wish fulfillment. So you're thinking about wish fulfillment. So be very careful as well what you what you're thinking about because this is what you are manifesting. Because you have this manifesting card here, so you are manifesting something quite amazing. So you've had this lovers situation. This is an end to a lovers situation, which has been a love hate situation. It's been built on faulty foundation, so it's crumbled. Possibly that you've been also juggling a lot, trying to do a lot, um, trying to keep all the balls in the air, working very hard and trying to do so much on your own. And this other person really didn't help or, you know, like add any sort of value. And so this is also you starting out on this new beginning. So you've manifested this new beginning here, which is like a, it's a message about money. So it's like um, it's like an abundance coming in for you. So the future is you working very hard and this is like getting like this is paying off your hard work is paying off so you're getting uh, blessings here this is like a job promotion or a new job or like a um, raise in salary because um, this is also you be very very strong so you have you've tamed this line like you've tamed the inner beast so really um, you are working so hard here and this is that you're rising above the competition you really are standing out so you really are like on top of the conflict so you really are above in all the competition so the work that you do is above the rest you know of um so you really are standing out and this is also you've done a lot of healing on yourself so you are like so you are able to um since you've healed from these past situations you are actually getting wish fulfillment now so this is actually wish fulfillment coming in for you where it's like you are getting this, um, there's a raise or something or like a new job sort of thing that's coming in. And it looks like someone might try and hold on to you. And maybe that you hold on to a past situation. So be very careful. There could be like a job opportunity that's coming in. Someone's going to try and hold you back from it. Um, so this is quite, um, this here is like stability as well. So you, you're holding on to this past situation or some situation here or someone else is holding on to you. But it's also that you're going to be financially stable. So because this is also like kind of penny pinching. So like trying to maybe you need to be very careful with your money as well. So, you know, to get this um, this new job or whatever it is, it might mean that you'll have a little bit of a struggle at first, but it's actually going to pay off. So this is your fears. You're fearing, you're fearing some sort of ending. You're kind of like um, you're fighting this ending. So it seems as if you had an ending, possibly with this masculine masculine energy, where you've had your heart broken, and it's sort of like you're fighting this ending. Could have been uh, Aries or a Scorpio, but it seems as if it's been quite painful. This person could have been quite controlling as well. It could have been that they. Um, tried to have everything their way so they really wanted to just um like my way or the highway so this has caused a bit of an ending so this is a new beginning so this is actually about a new beginning so 
Uh, maybe you're fearing stepping forward and you're letting go of a past situation. But it looks like you've trusted your intu intuition here, so you kind of have... You have a very powerful intuition, so you're able to sort of see the truth of things. And it's sort of like the truth has come out. And also because of how you've got a really strong intuition. You could have... You could be a tarot reader or like an intuitive person. Um, so this is also... Things are going to start moving fast here. So this is a new beginning that you're fearing, but it's like... Maybe you're fearing the speed of things as well. And you're, you're fearing that maybe you're thinking, do I really have a strong intuition or like what? So Spirit wants you to not fear and to try and heal from this heartbreak and to know that things are actually going to be more stable when you move forward as well. Because uh, the Emperor is about stability as well. So once you move forward and you kind of um, embrace this ending and new beginning, then you all feel, feel more ba balanced, you know? Others see you as this teacher. This is like a mentor. You're a mentor for others. And you you could be a spiritual teacher. Somebody that sort of um, helps people through their tough times. This is also that you've done a lot of healing on yourself. And you've had some difficult times, but you, you've recovered from it. So you're actually able to teach others now about it. You've had a lot of time out and a lot of time to heal. And it's also you've had to move forward from some situations You've moved forward probably from a love relationship and you've actually, um, you've kind of had a tough time with relationships and it's actually t taught you a lot. So you've actually been able to be a teacher to others. It's also that um, you've definitely had this ending here. So it's like a new beginning. So you've learned how to sort of conquer things and like overcome, you know, struggles and like especially with um endings like love relationships as well so this is celebrations as well and mal marriage and it's like you've had to walk away from some things and it's actually taught you a lot so you're able to teach and help others through that as well so you're hoping that you can that you do have a strong intuition because it's like part of you is doubting things so it's like you have doubt about your your skills when you are actually very intuitive and so you're kind of like a bit unsure about this masculine energy kind of so this person this this is like a teacher so this person seemed as if they weren't actually a very good mentor they this person wasn't really a good teacher to you they turned out to be actually quite um horrible and so it's like maybe that they were like a false teacher they weren't actually maybe it was it was like a false I'm sort of seeing false twin flame, but like somebody that actually was unstable, someone that was not a good teacher to you. So it looks like you. this is you trusting your intuition that this person was not a good person for you. They weren't really a good teacher towards you. So you're hoping that your, your intuition is right. So you're kind of like unsure. So this is a masculine energy in a way. Maybe it could be someone new that's coming in. This is Virgo energy. This is Aries as well. So this is also you building something new. There could be like you could be meeting this, um, like another person here, who maybe it, could, it looks like that you're healing from this past situation, and this is you building something new, and it's sort of like this person here from the past that was actually quite um, controlling is you're you're kind of cutting that person out because they weren't a very good teacher to you. And this is you building something new and doing the healing on yourself, and things are becoming very cheerful, and very happy. And it's sort of like, especially after you've kind of moved forward from this controlling energy who is actually not a very good um, person for you. So you weren't, you know, the right fit. So it looks like somebody is watching you very closely. Somebody could be sort of seeing you and they're wanting to come and speak to you maybe. So there's somebody here who is somebody that is a bit of a... This person can be quite inconsistent. They come in and they kind of just come in for passion or lust and then they kind of disappear again. So this person may be watching you. This could be somebody that you dealt with in the past who's actually just really not offered you anything stable. And it looks like you, um, this person is wanting to keep you trapped here. Maybe it's that you didn't know the truth of things and it, you, you kind of like maybe were obsessing with this person 
and you've got a blindfold on and you kind of keep yourself trapped but this is a self-imposed prison so this person is actually trying to keep you trapped here they're trying to hold on to you and they're watching you as well and wanting to come in and speak to you and so it's like they may be trapped as well and they might want to try and hold on to you in their trapped situation because they also got a lot of burdens they're carrying still so there's this um this person who's trapped in their situation so they want to hold you keep on hold of you and then keep you burdened as well so but spirit's saying that you're manifesting something new they've got this new pathway as well for you to go down and to sort of um know that someone is watching you and they're sort of maybe stalking and spying but you should, they're watching you move forward as well because you are ma manifesting this and this is you building something new here this is a new pathway Spirit wants you to know it's becoming balanced now. You're working with others to build something new. So this is like manifesting. You really are manifesting this. So because you planted the wand here, and this is really coming in for you. Spirit has your back as well. So this is like this leaves sprouting. So this is something new that you're you are building. And just know that someone is going to be watching you as well and watching it as you get this amazing sort of new opportunity coming in. So very cool. Bye.